It's Saturday morning and we're at Virginia International Raceway and we're looking pretty good. We're down on points right now because two out of the three last races have not been ideal for us. We need to get our, our points on the map again. Yeah, we need a good finish here at, at VIR to kind of bounce back to the point. Sorry, the tires uh, seemed okay. They don't seem flat spotted. I'm uh, never going to flat spot on grass. During practice yesterday, we had a few issues. Uh, throw straight off, I didn't hit anything. You know, heading into today, I'm confident in the team. I'm confident in Andrew. And I'm confident in myself that we can pull this one through. So I think it's uh, all positive thoughts. All we got to do is bring it home, stay out of trouble. Patrick Heisman, he's looking pretty racy there in the Synergy car, looking for a way by Andrew Davis. I was kind of running around in fourth, and we were nose to tail the top four of us, and then uh, we had a back marker that kind of started splitting us apart. Andrew Davis is being held up by Ian Boss, and that's allowed Kelly Collins, who we ride with, to bridge the gap. He should know better than to do what he did. I know you want to stay on the lead lap, but you let the leaders by, and then you follow him. Well, he's sideways. Davis loses under braking. Frustration overload at the lapped car of Ian Boss. After I spun, I saw him do the same sort of thing to four other cars, which all went off trying to get around him as well. Back up front, Wolf Hensler on the right, Nick Ham on the left, Porsche v Mazda. You have to say that Wolf Hensler is probably one of the top three or four Porsche drivers in the world, if not the best, because he is really on a charge here out front and trying to stretch that margin as best he can and hold on to that lead. A little trouble there, they touch. Hensler off, almost rolls the car, spins, goes across, makes contact through the barrier. I went wide and the Mazda dived in and at the exit he just gave me no room, but unfortunately there was a, a big bump. I jumped over the bump and uh, I, lo I lost the radiator. We've got radiator fluid coming out of the front of this car, a, quite a bit of body work missing on the front end of the car, also on the back end, so Wolf really did a job. Uh, it started off pretty good and uh, ended pretty bad, so. We have a lot of work for the rest of the season. Nathan Schwartz by getting his chance behind the wheel. This team saying that possibly their lead drivers might be getting back in. So all I had to do was the middle section of the race. I just basically had to keep it out of trouble. The car was great. I just was trying to stay consistent and not lose any positions. Andrew Davis is right there now. Within striking distance, there's no gap whatsoever. I'm going to finish fourth no matter what. i got to get past these two guys no matter what I have to do. Oh, Greg Wilkins has made a mistake. Wilkins has gone off and that has allowed Davis through. Now comes Tremblay, side by side, Sylvain is through. Beautiful, great job there. And yes, that was Dirk Werner getting by. Dirk Werner is your new race leader. Dirk Werner, win number one for Fine Marker Lowell's. To get fourth is, is really important. You know, we needed those points to get us back on the map. We're so close, Nathan and I, and I'm so excited about Laguna Seca.